Hey everybody, just a little full disclosure. We uh, set up a wonderful camera for this unboxing and it was supposed to be used to show detail on each of the special figures we opened. Unfortunately, I uh, forgot to press uh, record. So you're going to see us pushing a lot of figures to the side. That's just us trying to show you what we had, but it didn't work. I thought I'd just put still pictures in. All there right. Well, for it. welcome All again right. with, uh, to uh, Source Comics and Games opening up cool stuff. <laughs> um, this time we're going to open up some Pathfinder Battles Legendary Adventures packs. Uh, they're a little bit larger. They've got a uh, huge in them, and I believe three others. Yes. And right. they uh, they're really cool. They're coming out tomorrow, which is Wednesday, the 16th of November. So. Let's get started. October. What did I say? November. It's October. October. <laughs> <laughs> Well. That one. I don't cross the streams. All right, what we got. Nothing wrong with opening strong. A Chimera. Everyone needs a Chimera. Just getting out of here though. There we go. Yay! So this is the new Chimera. That is pretty beautiful. Well, speaking of strong, I think I may have found the uh, named bad guy. The Ashen. Here you go, Chad. <laughs> there you go. Make it work. Alright, look at him. Very scary looking. Alright. Starting out strong. What we got here? We got ourselves an orc charger. Really nice sculpt. Bugbear. An armored elf soldier. Well done, man. Great sculpts on these guys. Another bugbear? I've got two bugbears in the same pack. That's always nice. They've got a really neat look to them. Very scary looking. Although a lot of the Pathfinder art uh, makes for a very different looking figure. Or so. champion. There you go. And a white. Very scary. I don't know how to pronounce this. Alg Hall Luthu. Hall of Food. Looks like we got ourselves a nice big flying fish. It's like a baby aboleth. Oh, and of course, another beautiful giant, a cloud giant. She is gorgeous. She is gorgeous. Look at that. Look how cool that is. <laughs> she is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, this is awesome. Got ourselves a gnome rogue. Really. Well colored. Very cool. And a gnome, another gnome rogue. I think, Just yep, like every other two wizard. skulls. Like everything else. We double up always in this this oh, all these and there those are two skulls for the gnome rogue. We got ourselves a gnome soldier. Lots of gnomes going on in this set. Oh gnome, you didn't. I I cannot get. No, there we go. <laughs> Targeting is hard. Targeting is hard. 
And it also looks like all of these figures are going to be at an angle. Oh. <laughs> Look at that guy. Look at him. The Check orc. out this wraith. Oh, wow. Beautiful wraith. Oh, a goblin. A goblin guard. I love awesome. goblins in this. I, I love the Pathfinder goblins. They are my faves. Dinosaurs in this set? Uh huh. We got ourselves a pterodon. <laughs> yes. Kaka! <laughs> oh my lord, look at this thing. Holy oh. cats. Dragon Turtle! Dragon oh, Turtle! Teenage Mutant Dragon Turtles. Look at this thing. Oh, it's got the water effects oh. of it coming out of the water. I think it's brilliant. Imagine this coming right at you. Oh, look at that guy. I think it's awesome. He's hefty boy too. Oh, oh yeah. Smokes. They did not spare the resin on that guy. Got ourselves an orc brawler. Oh, to go with an orc brawler. We are doing real well with pulling the same fig with different sculpts. That's awesome. Oh, look at that. Look at that. This is what I like about, they, they've really upped their game. WizKids has done a very good job of making their stuff very value-based. I mean, you've got all these cool figs, and then they'll have multiple, multiple sculpts. So, you know, you approach... Not to be uh, like, yeah, another orc brawler. Oh, another orc brawler. And they're a wonderful uh, little yeah, gnome slinger this time. Man, you can be able to build your an entire gnome army with this with this line. That's pretty look cool. At, look at this shadow figure. Oh. This thing is... Fantastic. It's pretty creepy no. looking. It is. It's hard to see on the it's a black background. Bit of an eldritch, so uh, eldritch shadow type thing going on there. Look at that. Oh, I'll, hey. And sometimes you almost throw away one. There you go. Oh, another sweet oh. gobble. Our dragon turtle got a brother. Oh, oh. These dragon turtles are an uncommon or a common. This is going to be scary. Turtles. Yeah, you know, we get four. We can call them Michelangelo and Donatello, Leonardo. The other one, need a, Raphael. We need a wear rat to go <laughs> with them. Yeah. Another halfling slinger. Same sculpt. More brawlers. Yeah, the the appearance of the orcs and the goblins in this set. I mean, immediately, this is a great set. Yeah, this is going to be very useful for your role-playing needs. Oh, this is the third goblin we've seen a sculpt for. Ah, this is going to be a dangerous set for me. I love these goblins so much. Uh, and I end up just searching and searching for each one I can get. Bugbear. Oh, yeah, the, the bugbears are really neat. These, again, it's got a really very unique look to its head, and it still looks mean. Oh, we got kobolds in the set, too. Oh, of Kobold scale caster. Got himself a little flame. He is waiting. I am the Lord of Hellfire and I bring you fire! There we go. My biggin is some sort of grillion, probably. Oh, a Yeti, maybe? Yeah, you got it the first time. Yeti. It's not a grillion, it's a Yeti. It's like he's running through the through the woods of Montana. Oh, man. Or uh, <laughs> Seattle. Austin, whatever that this is. This is a great miniature. A dwarf oh, sorcerer. Oh, look at her. Fantastic cool. spell effects. Look at that. Very cool. Not like any other dwarf I've seen. That's fantastic. That's so More repeats here with the armored elf soldier. There we go. Got another Yeti, it looks like. And that's where they ended up with an elf ranger with a <coughs> decent sculpt. Oh, look at that. And duplicate pterodon. Another pterodon. All the pterodons. 
So here's a Hobgoblin Sharpshooter, another beautiful paint job. Oh, fantastic. Just gorgeous looking. It's got a shield in the back, beautiful bow. Most, uh, they're not as bent up sometimes they can get. Another shadow, scary guy. Eep. Last but not least, another Marauder it looks like. I will call you Tom Yeti. Oh, here we go. Hop Goblin Soldier. Have we seen this one yet? Um, no, oh, not that head. not that sculpt. We have a different hot we have a different uh, sculpt for that one. Man, this 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 box I'm opening right now, this is a hit, dude. We got a hobgoblin soldier. We got a goblin oh, guard. A goblin guard. With a horse chopper. And a kobold scout. This was a awesome, awesome box. Oh, such a great set. Look at that guy. And that's not even the rare cool figure. Yeah, tends to be the way it works. We got ourselves a storm giant. Oh, we got stormy giant. We got fiery giant. Cause why not? Here's a fire. Little fire, little storm. Look at those guys. The natural disasters. Oh yeah, Pete and repeat. Like Earthquake and typhoon up in here. It's like they're wrestling figures. Could be. <laughs> That's next week. <laughs> Do you know how cool it'd be if we could actually blind buy those those wrestling figures? You'd be it beside would, yourself. It would be amazing. <laughs> I would be. That wouldn't be much. Oh, this much is the dwarf rogue. The dwarf rogue. Again, just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful yeah. paint job on these figs. Again. Yeah, Whiz Kids has really stepped up their paint. Another game. bugbear skulker and a bugbear mauler. Oh, oh, so many bugbears. So much for having to work at getting a, getting an entire uh, encounter group together. Okay, so there's another halfling slinger. He seems to be pretty common. More goblins, though. Loves our goblins. Oh, the goblin dog slicer. There we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. give me all the goblins, please. I was just thinking the other day, man. I was, I sorely miss the other orc rampage. The goblins yeah. uh, set they had a little while, like Great about orcs. two or three years ago. Great goblins. Now I just... ended up with another cloud giant, which oh. is still an awesome sculpt. That's a really nice fig. Hey, everybody. <gasps> This is a halfling wizard. Wizard! Has he got a fryer? He's got a little fryer's thing on. Like he's got a bald pate. Oh no, dude! He's he's all business in the back. He's partying in the back. Oh business yeah, business in the front. There you go. You know he looks he looks like uh, Dungeon Master from uh, the, the 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 Dungeons and Dragons cartoon. That's exactly what he looks like. All right. Oh, hey Chad, I heard you like cloud giants. I, apparently, I do. Oh wait, that's a different sculpt though. This is in fact an alternate sculpt. This is what happens when your cloud, cloud giant, giant spear. decides to have a spear. The question is, are we gonna have one that's gonna ask us a question? <laughs> My last one in that pack is another uh, specter. No, what do they call them? Wait, wraith. The wraiths are cool though. All right, and our uh, last pair here. Behind, yeah. to keep showing off the cool thing. Yeah, another chimera. Oh, yeah. Thing your players don't want you to have four or five chimera. Hobgoblin Hobgoblin soldier, another one of those. I'm loving these hobgoblins. Dun 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 Different skull. I this think one, it's like it? a same, skull, same goal. Same I'm skull. taking the wreath. Another goblin. Here, I'll finish my rubbish so you can do the cool thing. Uh, a bugbear butcher. Have we seen the butcher yet? No, that's a new. That's also a pretty sweet new skull. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. And then we've got another, another gnome because apparently 
We are gnome heavy in this one. It is gnome. It is gnome. <laughs> Cobbled. All right, here comes the big one. This is a huge blue dragon, and it surely is. Oh, awesome. Look at that. Great paint job. Although, once again, the, you know, the only problem with some of these larger figures is that uh, sometimes their wings get squished, so it needs a little bit of reshaping done. Yeah, but, I would probably. Um, that's easy to do. You heat yeah, this up. Just Although, this actually looks, water. this is also gives you the luxury of not having to have things get knocked over when you're trying to put that an extra true. things. But that's beautiful. So. Fantastic dragon. It's good that's to finish it. strong. That's two booster bricks. All right. So all the, all the figures you've seen here are going to be priced up and uh, available tomorrow. And we'll have uh, plenty of the boosters uh, available as well. And uh, we're just really super excited. We have a, a new cabinet for these to display now. So a lot of our higher end uh, and larger figures are going to be easier yep. to see. And they'll be right with the rest of our bagged uh, singles as well. Always remember, we are buying these singles as well. If you happen to have extras that you want to uh, try to turn into something else, yep. uh, we buy them both for credit and for cash. So. Uh, hopefully we'll see you soon. Thanks. Okay. All right. Just wanted to add that we had a few extra things we'd opened up with another uh, entire brick or four, in fact, of uh, the next set. So here's a little set of some of the picks we have for that. We have a huge, huge collection ready to sell right away Wednesday morning. Thanks.